So you're thinking about moving to Renton, Washington. Well, stick around. In this video, we're gonna do a vlog style video showing you some of our favorite locations here in Renton. And then we're gonna hit three different neighborhoods and areas to show you um, different price points of homes, low, middle, and high. So you have an idea of how far your dollar goes here in Renton. So if you're looking to learn more, stay tuned. We're gonna get after it right now. Hey, if this is your first time on the channel and you wanna know all there is to know about living in King County, Washington or places like Renton, like we're talking about today, hit the subscribe button, tap the bell for notifications. That way you can be the first to be notified of a new video of Renton or one of our other favorite locations in King County. I'm Brad Decatur with the Decatur Home Team and we get calls, texts, and emails from people just like you every day who are looking to make their move to King County. So whether you're one day or one year away, we'd love to help you make a smooth move to King County. Contact info is below. So hit us up with a call, text, email, or hop on a Zoom call with us. So today, vlog tour Renton. We are at Grand Coulomb Park right now. So this is um, pretty close to the downtown area. We get next to the landing. We're on the water here. A bunch of picnic tables, uh, park, got tennis courts back here and playground over there. So just do a little pan to check it out. So Renton is pretty unique. It's really a huge city. Outside of Seattle, there's not a lot that are as big as Renton. So I think of it as really four different locations. There's the downtown Renton, the Highlands, then the Issaquah side of Renton, and then what we call Fairwood area. So we'll show you all four of those areas here in a second. Uh, but this is basically close to the downtown landing area. So we'll head to our next spot next. So Renton is located just below south of Bellevue, south of Newcastle. So it's a really good central location. It's right on the 405 and pretty close to the I-90. So as far as location goes, really close to get to Seattle, Bellevue, even the mountains. So pretty centrally located here. All right, stop number one, had to throw the beanie on. It's a little cold out today. So we're at the landing here. We're in front of the, we're in the Target parking lot, but the landing has everything you can imagine. So all the shopping, uh, commercial, entertainment, um, not, like a, not like a mall, but you know, all the different types of stores like Target here. Uh, right behind me with the net, you maybe can't see it on camera, but that's Top Golf. We'll show you some footage here of Top Golf. Super cool spot, most of you probably know what it is. Um, we got the bus lines right here, and there's also lots of condos and townhomes that are right here in the landing area. So pretty much all you need, there's Lowe's right there tons and tons of restaurants. So everything you need here in the landing. And this is again, pretty much next to that Coulomb Park. Um, also the Seahawks practice facility is pretty close here, not in the landing, but right off the freeway there at 405. Um, so this is the kind of next to the downtown area. Next up, we're gonna head to a few different locations for the vlog, then we'll hit some real estate. Right, house number one, you guys, this is gonna be our starter entry level price point. This house is a, just a two bed, one bath, about 800 square feet. And this is in kind of old town, downtown Renton. So our, our lower level price point is always gonna be down this downtown area for the most part for these starter homes. Um, but this one is pending at 450,000. It's actually just behind that one, but 
There's a lot of these houses that are similar in this area. So check that out. And then we'll do a drive through of the neighborhood so you guys kind of see what this uh, downtown area is going to look like. But pricing is going to be from this like low end 450 to like 600, depending on the size. Um, but there's not a lot of, you know, big neighborhoods with cul-de-sacs and sidewalks that are like, you know, for higher price points in this downtown area. So first stop downtown 450, check it out. All right, stop number two, guys. This is gonna be kind of more towards the middle price range here in Renton. We are in the Maple Hills community here, which is kind of in the uh, Renton Highlands area. We'll show you the, the Highlands kind of area in just a second. This one's a four bed, two bath, about 2,100 square feet. So more of your kind of average uh, size of home. It doesn't look very big, you can see here, but it's a basement home. Um, so Maple, Maple Hills community is a super great community uh, right next to the elementary school. So we'll take you around to show you the rest of the neighborhood. And this one is listed at 670,000. Right, guys stop number three here this is going to be more of the top range price point here this one is listed at 1.2 million it's about 2800 square feet so just side of 3000 uh four bed three bath there is some more like actual mansions here in the renton area but for like a regular neighborhood 1.2 is going to be kind of the the top range here so here's the house that is for sale really nice neighborhood sidewalks some cul-de-sacs you can do a little pan around here And this is the Highland Park neighborhood, which is um, a little bit east of the, the Highlands that we just were at, but so pretty much closer to the Issaquah side uh, where the, the school district does change from Renton to Issaquah in this area. Hey, thanks for watching the Renton vlog tour. Hopefully you found it helpful checking out some of the favorite areas here in Renton and some of the real estate. Renton is a really good spot. Like I said, you know, we think it's a really good investment area. It's just south of Bellevue, so it's got a much better bang for your price, or excuse me, bang for your buck as far as the pricing goes in the real estate market. But it's also really close to Bellevue in Seattle, so the commute is not very far. So we think it's a, got a lot of potential for future growth. And um, if you're looking to learn more about Renton specifically, I'd recommend checking out the pros and cons video. Uh, it's not all butterflies and roses, so Renton is a great spot, but there are some downsides. So if you're curious about those downsides as well as uh, upsides, check out the pros and cons video. We also have another video in Renton about the, uh, the map video and the best neighborhoods in Renton. So check those out. And if Renton is the first video that you've ever watched on our channel, um, 
check out the page and the playlist because we actually look at a lot of the other different cities in the King County area that we serve. So you can kind of find out what's the best fit for you. So if Renton's not the best fit or you're just curious about some of the surrounding areas like Bellevue, Issaquah, Maple Valley, you know, Snoqualmie, then you can check those out in the playlist to try and get a well-rounded um, grasp of what King County's like and to help find out what's the best fit for you. And again, that's why we're here. We're hoping to serve you guys, uh, the Decatur Home Team, so that the information is below to set up a call with us um, to help you kind of explore what areas are best once we find out your your specific situation and your needs in real estate and in the location that you're, you're looking at. We're born and raised in the area, so we're happy to help. Uh, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.